Kia ora and welcome back. My name is Zoe Stiebe, your vocal coach for today, and welcome back to my channel where I help you to sing more like the people in these videos at home. And if you want some freebies, free singing lesson, it's available in the description below. Today we're going to be taking a look at M by Hold, Numb Little Bug. Never heard of her, never heard the song. Can't wait to see what she's up to with her vocal technique. <laughs> Making her TV debut, performing her number one hit, Numb Little Bug, from her EP, Egg in the Backseat. Please welcome M. Byhold. I don't feel a single thing. Have the pills done too much? Haven't caught up with my friends in weeks. And now we're out of touch. I've been driving in it. And the world it feels too big Like a floating ball that's bound to break Snap my psyche like a twig And I just wanna see If you feel the same as me Do you ever get a little bit tired of life? Like you're not really happy but you don't wanna die Like you're hanging by a thread but you can't survive Cause you gotta survive Like your body's in the room but you can't really die I feel like the song just keeps going and going. I don't know where to stop. I know this song. I've heard it a couple of times on the radio. But this song really, it's very catchy. Hmm. Let's see about her voice. I, I like it. It sounds good. Great pitching. If you're wanting to work on your pitching, check out my video up here because I go into like proper depth about how to work with Nail the Pitch. It's a free app. Now let's go and take another look at it. I have to be honest, there's nothing to really like write home about about this vocal. But it's very current. I don't feel a single thing. Have the pills done too much. Haven't caught up with my friends in weeks and now we're out of touch. I've been dry. Can you hear that? Ah, da, 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 where she does that little flip. Now, if you're wanting to work that into your voice, um, into your singing, I want you to think about blowing over the top of a bottle. Hoo, hoo, now, I'm not saying that M is a donkey in any way, shape, or form. She's a beautiful young woman. But um, you can pretend that you're a donkey. Ooh, ooh, and do that. Ooh, and really make quite a big pitch change. Ooh, and then you can work on uh, making it on the same pitch. Ooh, ooh, da, 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 da. I mean, she changes pitch, doesn't she, on that one? Um, but it's a really cool little exercise. If you're thinking about keeping the beginning of the song nice and quiet, which I recommend to everybody that they do. With my friends in weeks, and now we're out of touch. I've been driving in it late, and the world, it feels too big. Like a floating ball that's bound to break. Snap my psyche like a twig. And I just want to see if you feel the same as me. Do you ever get a little bit tired of life? Like you're not really happy, but you don't want to die. Like you're hanging by a thread, but you can't survive. Because you got to survive. Like you're... And you can hear that, like I gotta survive. That's again that same sort of flip that she was doing before, keeping the volume really, really low. Now, I always say that if you are thinking about going further up in the range, I want you to think about getting smaller. Friend, like I gotta survive. Because as you're adding in breath to the sound, if I was to keep going at the same volume, friend, like I gotta survive, I'm gonna just blow air right out. And microphones really don't like air. So you're gonna think about reducing the airflow as you're going further up. So friend, like you gotta survive. And then that's gonna also help you with your pitching. <laughs> Thank you. But let me know down in the comments, what do you struggle with the most when you are singing quietly? Are you someone that can sing quietly with ease or are you someone who really struggles to sing quietly? Hmm, I'm looking forward to hearing from you.
Okay, I don't know how this song is going to progress, but this is a really perfect way to see that it's not all about the big notes. It's not all about belting the shit out of a song. This is so intelligently written. I'm like, my brain is really struggling to keep up with all the lyrics, um, but it's a really, really well written song from what I'm hearing. I can't wait to listen to it like a couple more times in depth. But if you are someone who is looking to work on their songwriting, then I highly suggest that you just start. Just start. I'm fairly certain that M Byhold has been working at this for a very, very, very long time, and she has honed her skills through actually practically writing songs. So it's all about practice, 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 practice. Yes, I'm just broken and broke. The prescription's on its way with the name I can't pronounce and the dose I gotta take. Boy, I wish that I could count because I've been swollen. Get a little bit tired of life Like you're not really happy But you don't want to die Like you're hanging by a thread But you gotta survive Cause you gotta survive Like your body's in the room But you're not really there Like you have to be inside But you don't really care Like you're fresh out of love But it's been in the air And I'll get us repair just say that this is like now that I'm really listening to the lyrics this is a really serious topic and I definitely don't want to like brush over it really lightly it's really a topic that hits home for me because I've struggled hugely with my own mental health and I've been working with a fantastic life coach for the past year called Taryn West you might have seen her on my podcast episode up here where we talked about motivation uh, she's also a guest speaker in my online singing course which is available in the description below I have 50% off at the moment for the summer as we're leading into the start of the new school year I cannot wait so check out the link in the description below for 50% off that which is like insane but back to the mental health bit, mental health is not something that just should be brushed under the carpet. You've got to do something about it. Um, you've got to get help when you're having these types of thoughts because it's about working through this together and working with a professional. But let's keep watching M. <laughs> Get a little bit tired of life Like you're not really happy But you don't wanna die Like a numb little bug That's gotta survive That's gotta survive Okay, we were right at the end there anyway And I just like paused it such a lovely performance. And I just want to say, M, so awesome to see you live. Congratulations on your first television performance. That's super cool. So I'd love to hear from you. What was your favorite part of that performance? Um, I really love that although it was a first television performance, the chick looked cool, calm, and collected. I'm fairly certain that inside she wasn't. I mean, she might have been, I don't know. And that's absolutely fine, no matter what the story was. But such a lovely, lovely performance. Really great to see that you don't necessarily need to sing super duper loud in order to get the attention. It's an incredibly intelligent song. And it just, honestly, although I was like dancing around, I was full on listening to the lyrics and it just really like hit me like a stab in the heart because this is just so important. And as I say, get help if you're really struggling. Um, that's the most important thing. Reach out to someone. Check out the link in the description below for my life coach. I love working with Taryn West. And without her, I know that I would be in the same burnout, lumpy mess that I was in last year. Uh, and she really, really helped me through a massive tough time. So thank you so much for joining me today. Happy practicing. Have an awesome rest of your day. Kaki